what's up you guys welcome back to my channel so today's gonna be a different type of video i'm really nervous <laughs> i'm about to like, get my hair done i haven't really told a lot of people just like mainly like my family that i am getting my hair done i'm getting it done by my good friend daisy um she does amazing hair you guys need to check out her instagram i'm gonna be posting it down below her work is just amazing and she's really professional and I really do recommend her. I've never gotten my hair done by her but I can already speak on like other people's experience that I do know and I'm just, I don't know, you guys need to check out her Instagram because it's amazing so give her a follow. Um, so yeah, I'm really nervous like I said. I, I don't know, I've dyed my hair so I'm going to do like a caramel blonde type of, I don't know which, how it's going to look at first, like an ombre type of look. So I'm gonna pull over somewhere and then I'll finish talking to you guys. You guys, I am so dead right now. I was like, oh, I have so much time. I mean, I'm, I'm not gonna be late, but like, I was like, oh, I have so much time. Um, Cause I got out of class early, so I, like, I, I was like a little bit early. And I literally went to the wrong, like I didn't know there were multiple locations of this salon. It's like the Bella, so I don't know how to ever pronounce it. I'm not as daisy like I pronounce it. Um, so I can give you guys more information, but I literally went to the wrong location. Good thing like this location isn't that far like, It's only seven minutes away from where I am right now But I literally was like, Ooh, I'm gonna like, you know, park and then I'm gonna like vlog a little bit But yeah, I don't have time to vlog when I get there, so I'm just gonna vlog like this and yeah, so so yeah, basically, I'm just gonna get my hair done. Um, it is kind of a big change for me. Um, the last time I had blonde hair was my senior year of high school. I did this for only like three months though. Like it was only like, I'll say three months that I had kept it blonde. But yeah, guys, I'm so nervous. It's gonna be probably, I don't know. I'm just gonna kind of let her do whatever she thinks will look good because I trust her. Um, I trust her judgment as well. But she did tell me maybe like a few, like more than one session, which so that's something I'm okay with because like I know she's like she knows what she's doing and it's gonna take a while to get like an ashy color I'm going for an ashy color, but she said that the warm warmer tones may grow on me So we'll see you guys are gonna see um, The whole like process and everything and yeah, I've never done a vlog like this before but I thought it'd be fun to like kind of like capture these moments um, so in the next clip you'll see I'm probably gonna like introduce Daisy and stuff and then I'll probably have her like explain what she's gonna be doing because honestly like I said I really don't know I just kind of sent her a few pictures uh, for like reference of like what I'm thinking of wanting to do so yeah you guys will see in just a second okay. your camera's nice thank you so I'm with Daisy now hi and she's just gonna tell you some of her information and what she's gonna do to my hair so we're here at Balazzo 2.0 today. This is where I work. Uh, my Instagram is Daisy's Hair for those of you that don't follow me. And so today we're working on Mia's hair. She's got a lot, a lot of hair, but um, we're kind of gonna try to tackle some old color in her hair. So I don't know, do you want me to kind of like go over your hair with your camera? Yeah, I can. And then you can just like flip it. Okay. So lots of hair, it's freaking long, this is crazy. <laughs> so she's got some old color in here and we kind of met in the middle and said that we were gonna try to kind of tackle some of this out of here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in with some natural balayage just for her first session because I don't want her to fade out really weird if we go too drastic today. So yeah, we're gonna do kind of like a natural balayage, some balayage highlights in here and kind of see what happens. So throughout the process, we'll be kind of letting you guys know too, I guess, see what goes on. You can kind of see behind the scenes and I'll explain what happens when there's some old color in here and what our possibilities are. Go so beans. Okay. It looks so long. Oh, your hair? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I never yeah. realized. It's like pretty good. Really? Yeah. Well, I mean, it's pretty brown, which is a good thing. Yeah. I mean, at least it's not orange, dude. Oh my gosh, I don't want to get it dirty. It's okay, it's okay. Okay. So, she's pretty brown on the bottom and then towards the top, she's a little lighter. Um, I'm guessing this is kind of where her natural color is and then it kind of goes down into her old color right here. But that's okay because at least she's not orange, she's brown, yeah. so. so it's way better. <laughs> here you go, girl. Thank you. Thank you. So it's 
a month later actually it's like two months later um but I'm back here I'm about to get my hair done once again um, my hair has lightened a lot more since Daisy first had done it but yeah I'm gonna go in and I'm hoping for the best I hope that it'll like lighten a lot more now because it has been some time and my hair has like gotten a bit lighter so yeah hopefully we'll see what happens my hair is so gross right now because um, it's recommended to come with it dirty and I hate having dirty hair. I can only go like maybe one maybe two days So yeah, it's a little dirty. So that's why it's up right now um, but, but Yeah, it is March 13th and I'm ready for Some type of change honestly because I'm just kind of I'm kind of tired of my hair right now But I'm excited. Hopefully things turn out good. I trust her like I said, um so I know it's gonna look bomb. But yeah, I'll see you guys right now when I'm in the salon. I feel like it looks better in person. I know, dude. For real, let me see. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It does not. You should get it like with the with the. Over here. Yeah. Let's go over. Hold on. Yeah. Uh, I feel like a new person. I know, too. <laughs> oh my god, you're kind of dirty. It'll come off. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Oh my gosh, dude, so I'm gonna do like cute. this slow motion, like Yeah. Why are you so cute? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Here you go, boo. Let me take it. Okay, I'll put it right there. So, hello. Um, it's about two days. Yeah, two days later, it's Friday, yeah. So it's two days later and I finally washed my hair last night. I, well, I didn't wash it obviously because it was like fresh and new, but yeah, this is how my hair looks right now. I feel like it looks way um, darker on camera compared to like how it actually is. But hold on, let me just get going. Okay. So yeah, it's honestly a lot darker on camera than how it looks and I used purple shampoo last night so I feel like it kind of like lightened it a little bit more. Um, but yeah, I was editing the video last night, the hair video that you're watching <laughs> and I just realized I didn't really have a lot of footage. So yeah, for the first time I got my hair done, I didn't end up recording a lot, I'm like the worst. <laughs> I don't know we were just like really busy um, and it wasn't much to really record if you guys saw in like the picture of how it how it ended up looking the first time it honestly didn't have a huge um, like transformation I guess you could say so um, yeah but that was just the way it looked just because my hair had box dye in it so it was kind of harder to um, lighten but this time obviously it lightened a lot but like I said you probably can't really see too much um, but yeah I just decided to kind of vlog a little bit um, just because I didn't really have a lot of footage and I just want to start like maybe doing like vlogs like this 
Um, but yeah, I'm on my way to school right now. I have class. But, um, yeah. I'm thinking of going <clears throat> to Ulta later to pick up a few things. I really want to try the the Wet n Wild Stick Foundation. I really want to try that. Um, it's only like $5 too. And I really want to try that. <clears throat> excuse me. The new e.l.f. The Camo something. The new concealer. If you guys no makeup you guys know what i'm talking about they say it's like a dupe for shape tape and i need it i'm probably gonna go after class if not sometime this weekend but i'm thinking today because i just really i'm really like anxious to try the new stick foundation and i also really want to um make a video tomorrow kind of like an not really like an updated tutorial but just like a just casual like sit down get ready with me type of thing and I want to try the new products um, and let you guys know how I like them so yeah I'm just going to class right now like I said but if I do end up going to Ulta which I'm pretty sure I will I'll update you guys in like one second <laughs> So I finally made it back and I was on like a freaking hunt for this makeup you guys. Um, I went to Ulta, I have a few things that I just want to show because I'm bored. <laughs> so I ended up having to go to Walgreens for the foundation, um, the Wet n Wild one. And honestly it's so hard to like shade match yourself especially because they don't even have like testers at like drugstores. But I got this one and hopefully it ends up matching me I don't know we'll see you guys will see in my video that I'm filming tomorrow like I said like a little new updated get ready with me type of thing um, and then like I said I did end up getting the elf concealer I'm just really nervous because look at it so it looks pretty light right but I opened it and it's like I don't know, it probably looks light, but like it, it's actually pretty dark and I don't know if it's going to be light enough. So we'll see. I don't want to like judge it too quickly. Um, like I said, at Walmart, they only had two shades and I was like, really? Really? Um, and then I said I got the this little cucumber water from Wet n Wild as well. I got this. I love this eyeliner. It's like two, three bucks from Wet n Wild. And then I got my friend this. Um, because everyone needs this highlighter. Um, I'll probably feature this in my video tomorrow as well. But these are the Wet n Wild highlighters, the loose ones. Look how huge they are. They're like the size of a translucent powder, and you only need like the tiniest amount. Like dipping your brush in, like a tiny bit, is like way more than you even need. So I got this for my friend because it was her birthday. And then this is what I'm really excited about: the Anastasia of the Hills dewy set setting spray oh my gosh i'm gonna show this to you guys right now like i'm literally i don't want to mess up the packaging because it's so pretty um this is it like i saw the tester inside they only have it at ulta right now um and so i don't know when they're putting it in sephora but look at how beautiful this is i love the max fix max the mac fix plus one spray and this is very similar like the packaging but it looks so pretty like it's sparkly but like the inside it's not actually like sparkly oh, i just want to try it are you kidding oh it smells so good it smells like coconut i'm obsessed oh my gosh okay i'm excited i'm gonna use this tomorrow as well so stay tuned for that and then i got one for my friend as well hopefully she doesn't watch this because <laughs> yeah this one i got you for your birthday i got her one too because honestly if you're my friend since, since i have a job now but if you're my friend and it's your birthday i'm gonna hook you up like um i love getting uh, people makeup for their birthday i feel like that's something that i want to like do more often okay don't get crazy with the makeup because it is expensive but like i've gotten people like highlighters and stuff like people I get people things that I like, so if you're like a true friend of mine, I got you. But yeah, this is um, my birthday gift because this combination, like you can probably set your face and then put this and you're you're done. So yeah, this is a perfect birthday gift because 
want to get something for birthday. Um, and then I also got this. So this isn't for me. This is going to be for one of you guys. Um, I'm starting to get like little makeup items here and there because I am going to have a giveaway at 500 followers. So make sure you're, follow you're following. Well, subscribers, I mean. But make sure that you guys are following me on Instagram and here on YouTube because this is just one of the things you'll be getting. This is the Take Me Back to Brazil palette. It is honestly, like, I feel like if you're into makeup or if you're getting into makeup and you want to get into makeup, this is, like, the perfect, like, starter palette. Not even starter palette. Like, I would get this. I don't even have this palette, and I have been wanting to get it. Um, I didn't want to like, open it, but I want to show you guys that you guys, what you guys will be getting. It's, like, amazing. Um, Morphe had... Uh, the 35B palette, which is like the colorful one, but they, I think they discontinued it, and that's the one I have right now. Um, so if you really want like a colorful, perfect palette, this is the one for you. So subscribe right now so you can be entered to win this. Um, obviously, I'm not at 500 yet, so I'm going to be getting more makeup items here and there, maybe even one of these. So stay tuned and tell your friends, your mom, your dad, your tia, your nana. Tell everyone to subscribe right now because maybe they'll win it and then they'll share it with you. Um, yeah, that's just a little bit of what I got. Um, like I said, I was editing and I wanted to make this video a little bit longer. But honestly, this is kind of fun. Although I didn't like record in like the stores because I'm a little shy. Um, I want to start vlogging like this. So let me know if you guys like this. I don't know. I feel like very comfortable like talking. To the camera and I don't know I like it so let me know if you guys like this vlog style type of thing I feel like you guys get to see my personality a little bit more it's more like personal than like just a makeup tutorial um, but yeah let me know uh, more videos you guys want to see and then yeah I'll probably just update you guys a little bit more on my hair I know it is going to be getting lighter I washed it for the first time last night with purple shampoo and conditioner and it like I don't know how but overnight it like lightened a little bit just because of that but this is how it looks it's really weird because it looks different in different types of lighting like I took a little video on snapchat and it looked like blonde um but I love it so much I hope you guys enjoyed this video and like the first part of it like I said I'm sorry it's kind of like not the best footage of me like getting my hair done but um that's what I got. <laughs> but yeah, uh, make sure, like I said in the vid beginning of this, this video, you guys go and follow Daisy right now. Even if you don't like hair, you're not into hair, her page is so aesthetically pleasing. I love looking at it. Um, so go give her a follow on Instagram for me. And yeah, you can book an appointment if you want your hair done because her prices are very reasonable in my opinion. And um, if you want good quality hair, then I think it's worth it to pay like her prices because a lot of girls I know have gotten their hair jacked up and they spent all this money for nothing. But yeah, um, like I said, make sure to subscribe. You might get this palette soon. I'll be getting more items for you guys within my next paychecks. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, make sure to give this video a like and I'll see you guys in the next video. That's going to be my get ready with me, so get ready for that. Bye!